Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'll be trying something a bit different from my usual. So I'm gonna try uh, today tempoyak mixed with bread. Actually it was suggested my, by my brother when I started my new channel. He did ask me to try on like different types of food. And one of his proposal is to actually try on tempoyak. And I actually did a bit of research, I actually watched some videos on how tempoyak was made and also what does we what dish type of dish that usually they will use tempoyak to cook with. And I never had any chance to try tempoyak before in my life. And I went on to Shopee, I bought my tempoyak and it arrived yesterday. And the best part of all, when it arrived, it came in a bubble wrap. And what happened was, was when I actually opened up the bubble wrap itself, it actually leaked out and the smell was... I, I can't imagine how the smell was like. It smells like durian, but it also smells like a rotten durian in a way. So I had no choice to actually seal it up here just in case my house have like any smell so i'm trying to contain the smell here and also at the same time i'm trying to open all my windows up to make sure that there is lots of air ventilation so my house don't smell like tempoya and one one of the ideas is to actually have me to eat with rice but i my house actually don't have any rice because it's quite a new house so i actually replace it with bread bread instead and I'm gonna use the I'm gonna take the tempoya to spread the tempoya on the bread and try to taste it. Hopefully, I don't vomit. And I actually prepared like a puke bucket as well, just in case anything goes wrong. This is my best friend right here. Okay, so now I'm gonna try. Oh my god. Okay, no no smell so far, but. I, this morning I tried not to eat anything because I'm afraid that I'm going to puke all my breakfast out of once so I tried to keep my stomach empty, I only had like a cup of coffee <coughs> yeah, it smells The wind started to blow and I started to smell the durian, the tempura smell Okay Okay, just for you guys to see how does it actually looks like it's just a small jar, I bought it on Shopee, it cost me like 13 ringgit, 10 ringgit for the tempoyak, 3 ringgit for the delivery. Okay, and it really looks like a fermented durian. Okay, hopefully I don't puke. Oh my god, it's horrible. Okay guys. I'm gonna make sure that I at least eat it with one bread. I'm gonna try my best. You know, honestly, I love durian, but somehow, this is like another level, like my eye is teary now just by smelling it. Okay. Oh my god. You know, it smells like a trash car, like trash lorry that driving around to collect trash. It smells like that plus durian smell. Oh my god. Hey guys, one break, tempoyak. Just to make sure that you guys see that I don't cheat. Ah. I can tell you it smells horrible. Okay, I'm gonna spread more of this. I'm gonna close this just horrible. Hey guys, cheers. Oh 
actually brought this to actually spare on just in case. Oh my god, the first bite was bad. Smells like, oh my god, it tastes like, like literally tastes like rotten durian. Okay, I'm gonna go for my second bite, this time without the help of the cranberry juice. Oh my god. No, my house never had like any house life where I'm staying like high rise eating floor. But I just saw like a housewife just fly and just pass through the camera itself. That is how bad the smell was like. Oh my god, it's just horrible. Like whenever I take my first bite, whenever the smell actually come in, like oh my god, it actually hits me. like my whole nerve system and all is like so bad. I still got another half. I'm gonna try to finish at least half of this. It doesn't. It smells like durian, but it doesn't taste like any. Like durian is the bomb, not this. It's just horrible. Like. It's just so bad. Like I just can't eat it on its own because it's just so bad. Like I need something to actually gulp it down with because the taste is just horrible. You know, there's one particular dish that was famous with tempoya. It's called. Uh, Kan pat patin tempoya, I think something like this. It was actually a dish that I do look forward to try in the future. In the something that I did try to hunt for it in Penang, but I can't find any that is convenient for me to go to. But after this experience itself, I'm not sure if I'm gonna ever do this, ever try this dish again. I still need water. I still need my juice to actually help me to digest this. I just can't swallow it. Okay. 
since this is my first time trying tempoyak, so I would like to just share like my experience on this particular item. Honestly, I hate it. Nothing nice about it. Like maybe I'm eating it in a, in a wrong way. Many people actually tell like how good tempoyak is. Not is something that is definitely not for me. It's something that I do not eat in the future. Maybe I'll give it a try for the next for a dish that cooks with tempoya, but not the raw tempoya itself. The raw tempoya is horrible. Anyway, thank, thanks for watching and if you guys find this channel to be interesting and I hope you guys can actually subscribe to my channel and just give a like on this video and comment on the box down below. And if you do have like, any dish that you want to introduce me to try, just DM me or just drop on the comment box below and I will be trying as many dish as possible. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys again soon.